for your backyard barbecues and fun. We might be the only family that doesn't have a corn meal set yet, so we thought we'd try and make ours. The materials for this project are pretty simple. We need three one by three by eights, one two by three by eight, and two sheets of 24 by 48 inch pre-cut plywood sheets from Lowe's out of oak. Tools, we need Craig jig, drill, some hex bolts, washers, hex nuts, dowels, a compass, and we plan to make ours portable, so we're going to use these sash locks to keep them together so that they can carry as one unit. All right, for this project, you're just gonna need four two by threes cut to 12 inches, two two by threes cut to 22 and a half, four one by threes cut to 22 and a half inches, four one by threes cut to 48 inches, and those pre-cut two foot by four foot oak plywood boards. Let's do some pocket holes. We're gonna put our frame together using pocket holes. That's how we do everything. All right, we're just dry fitting it, make sure everything fit properly. We really only needed pocket holes in the two by threes that are 22 and a half inches and the one by three that's 22 and a half inches. This is the top, the bottom, and the center brace. Center brace, keep it nice and sturdy. Give it that pop. All right, let's All assemble right. the frame. We're gonna glue it and assemble the frame. All right, we're gonna attach the top to the frame. We're gonna glue the top first. Oh. <laughs> Time to start making holes, or, or a hole. Top, which is the top? Oh, that's the top. Top. We're gonna find the center. Doo -doo. And come nine inches down. Yeah, then we're going to draw a six inch hole using a three inch radius on a compass. Now we wanted a six inch hole saw, but that thing was like $40, so. I said we would use it all the time. <laughs> all the time. <laughs> I'm always making six inch holes. <laughs> no. So we're going to go this route. What are you doing? Making a six inch circle. <laughs> Bam! Ah! 
We're gonna drill a pilot hole on the inside. On the inside, yeah. kind of near the, uh, kind of near the Jim Jam. Kind of near the edge, but not on the edge. Too close to the edge. Dynamite. Oh. It's down by your feet. <laughs> That's not dynamite, but it'll work. All right, we're gonna flip it over. We're gonna attach the legs. This thing's gonna walk the f out of here. No. We're gonna flip it over. We're gonna attach the legs. I like the first one. All right, we're gonna attach our legs. <laughs> All right, first we're gonna round the tops of them so that we can make them swivel up and down. And to do that, we're gonna measure an inch and a quarter in and an inch and a quarter down. It's two and a half inches thick. Yeah. Half of that. We're gonna flip it over and trim the legs so that it'll lay flat. Take them off and give them a trim. Time to attach them with the bolts and washers. You want the big washers or the little washers? Um, I need a washer. And then I put it through, and then I want a big washer, and then a big washer. Two big washers, a nut and jam, a washer and a nut. Alright, 
There you go. That's how you make a cornhole. Now we're gonna make a second one. Then we're gonna paint and stain, and I have a cool vinyl decal that's gonna go on the front of it.